when one surrenders to Krishna, one becomes like the fish in the sea. The fish within the sea is utterly dependent at every moment on the water of the sea for their survival. In the same way, when we dive deeply into the infinite sea of Krishna's love and we surrender to that love, we cannot live even a moment without it. It is a fate that appears worse than death to forget Krishna for even a moment. This is the teachings of Srila Rupa Goswami, to always remember Krishna and to never forget Krishna. A devotee of the Lord, this is his only fear in all of creation. A devotee who is raised to the standard of proper faith does not fear physical pain, does not feel fear, infliction, or persecution to one's body, to one's prestigious position, does not feel poverty, does not fear being rebuked even by one's most intimate loved ones. Srila Madhavendra Puri, he prayed like this, ever since I have tasted the sweetness of Krishna's devotional service. I do not care. People are laughing upon me. They are criticizing me. They think I'm crazy, fool. What is he doing? Let the whole society say what they want. But my mind is finding unlimited satisfaction simply remembering the loving service of the Lord. But a devotee has one fear, that he may forget Krishna for a moment. Sahanisthan Mahachidram Somoha Satcha Vibrama Yan Mahura Tanchanam Bhapi Vasudevam Nachinda. A devotee considers that even the most insignificant second, even a twelfth of a second, a moment in forgetfulness of Krishna, is the greatest loss and the greatest misfortune in all of the creation. You were listening to Radhanath Swami on devotionalnectar.com.